how to create a three post grid on canva for your instagram post hey everyone and welcome we hope you're all doing great in this video i'll show you step by step how to achieve this now first you will need to just go ahead and open up your canva.com and then from here we are just going to create a blank document with a custom size this is just going to be a size that is uh, very horizontal and this is just going to allow us to create a design uh, throughout the three different posts so let's just go ahead and get started so we can just go ahead to custom size here and we want to basically add the size in here so obviously the width is going to be a little bit longer than usual so we want to go for three two four zero and then the height is going to be pretty much the same as usual so 1080 and just make sure the units is in pixels now create a new design from here we basically can just you know get started with our design here uh, so you can just think of them as one two three or you can actually use a grid um uh, template to help you you know sort of actually uh, know exactly the spaces between so we can actually go ahead and add a grid element to help us so we can just go to elements here uh, and we can just go for the uh grids here and we want the three ones so this one right here click on that and it's just going to actually frame it for us now in here we to actually set up lines just so we can actually know exactly the three different posts here and we can again just go to elements uh, go back and we can just go ahead and add a few lines just to help us understand it then we can just basically remove them so we want to just go ahead and make sure it is 90 degrees and we can just add it right between the two right like so and then we can just duplicate this uh like so add the other one right over here now these lines are just going to be imaginary imaginary lines that we can just basically remove after we are done like so and now we can just simply remove the grid now we can actually tell that this is the first one second one third one if you want to take the lines to the bottom you can feel free to do so but anyways so now what we can do is just go ahead and design it as we would so we can just go ahead and add some sort of uh background if you want feel free to do so uh just make sure it is at the back so we can actually see the lines so position is going to be um backward okay i can't really do that for the time being so let's just go ahead and uh remove it okay i just did control z and just went back anyway so now we can just feel free to add some text for example add whatever you actually feel like adding it's going to be you know the designing aspect of it, of this is going to be completely uh for you to decide what you actually want to do with it uh so just go ahead and design it as you like and then obviously you can feel free to remove the lines after you are done with your design and you want to basically just go to share option from the top right and download it as a png file click on download and then we want to basically split them and then from instagram you would want to basically post them from last to first in that order so now to split them you want to go to another website here which is pinetools.com search for split uh, and it's just going to give us the splitting image option. Hopefully, it's going to come up anytime soon here. Or actually, just, let's just go ahead and look for it manually. It should be right down here. Split image. So we can just go ahead and select this one. And once this loads in, I'm just going to show you what's next. Okay, great. So now you do need to just click on choose file. Uh, obviously, just go for the one that we just downloaded, which is this one. And then we basically want to go for the how to split the image. You want to make it horizontally. And then quantity of blocks, you want to make it three. Like so. And then we are pretty much set. We can just go to set it up as PNG and click on split image and then we have uh, the images here so first last uh, second and third so in instagram once you actually download these you want to upload this one first this one second and then this uh, this is going to be the last one so just go from uh, last to first and this is pretty much all you need to do so hopefully you found this video to be helpful and thanks for watching